It's Saturday Sal McGundy, everybody. Saturday Sal McGundy. It's actually one of my favorite days because that's kind of like a mixture of everything. And uh, what this uh, video is about is my agenda for the day. It's Saturday Sal McGundy. Now, I have two knives that this weekend, they're fixed blades. I'd like to put some scales on it. One of them is going to be that, uh, if I can, that K-Bar Be Becker 18 in all black micarta scales. And today I got bolts coming in for handles, miscellaneous size bolts, really cool. I got them off Amazon. And uh, they're for handles on fixed blade knives. So the what I'm trying to say is the bolts that are on the K-Bar is gonna be difficult for me to use with that right there, I think. I have to investigate it. Anyway, I won't be doing that one today, I don't think. That might be tomorrow. But today, I would love to get on that uh, BPS knife using my snakeskin micarta. And according to my calculations, I'm only going to be sanding a little bit off the top. So I'm hoping that I still get a snakeskin look. You know what I'm saying? Because it's not going to be like that gonna be well you know what I'm saying there's different layers right there and as you see if I focus out as you uh, sand it you get into a different uh, look a different design but I want to do that it's very cloudy it's kind of windy dreary uh, so I won't be working on the house unless it clear it up uh, anyway that's my that's what I like to do but my wife just asked me informed me that we'll leave about 11 o'clock she is going to Crackle Barrel. She felt like having some chicken and dumplings. And I'm going there to get some catfish, turnip greens, and some more turnip greens, and some fried okra and cornbread. That's going to be a lunch. So that's going to take uh, a couple hours out of my day. So when I get back is when I'll probably work on that fixed blade knife. But this morning I went grocery shopping, went to Walmart, and I first saw this this item right here off Addicted to do, Addicted to Blades 2. I'll put his channel in the descriptions of this video. If you're not subscribed to him, I'm sure you are, but if you're not, subscribe to him. The guy's incredible uh, slicing and uh, great content. It's just very entertaining, uh, very educational. And he always puts up knives that uh, kind of gives us a heads up. So this was over the holidays at Walmart for $25, okay? Which is an incredible deal. So I went back there to check out, you know, I had to. And uh, they had this down at $20 now. So I wanted to let y'all have a heads up. Uh, Walmart is probably uh, just take, you know, trying to sell that out so they can restock. But what this is, Right here is the Survivor's Edge Knife. It's called the Survivor's Edge Knife. This, of course, is your Mac V. I've had so many of these in the past few years, a couple years, and I have one, the first one I got, and it is worn out because I actually uh, wore it on my keychain. And the others I gifted out. It's just a great little tool to keep on your keychain. I'll open this up and we can look at it later. And this is, of course, is the Field Knife which I have an orange one and the black one. And I got this way back. Uh, just, uh, this is what, this is a fantastic knife. It really is for the money. And I think I got this for like uh, 19 bucks one time on sale on SOG site back a couple of years ago. And I kept it in my toolbox in the back of my truck, truck bed, you know what I mean? It was a go-to. And then uh, I think it was Knife Center knife center knife center had an exclusive orange handle and i've got that in my collection i don't use it okay but i have uh, thrown this the field knife is super balanced it's got a nice rubbery grip uh it is full tang you're wondering why i'm not taking it out of the package i will later uh i'm very interested in this thing right here uh Addicted to Blaze 2, he had it all out. He was checking them out, and uh, he was slicing with it, checking the uh, the sharpness out of the package. 
Of course, he always fine tunes everything. But I wanted to give y'all, uh, this is very interesting. Okay, I looked up on the SOG site. Uh, one of them I didn't find. I didn't find the uh, Survivor's Edge. But on another site, this goes for $19.99. Yep. That goes for $19.99. Has a little paracord thing going there. And it has have a sheath. Right there. This is the field knife sheath. It has that slot for cutting cords so you don't have to remove your blade. Now dig this. Okay, so far. So far, this is 20 bucks. Just call it 20 bucks. The Mac V, I knew this. They give this away sometimes. Uh, if you go on their on SOG site, if you buy, you, you know, you spend so much for a knife, they'll throw this in. But this alone runs $16.95. $16.95. Okay, and that's something. Sixteen ninety five for a multi tool. That's the Mac V multi tool. Oh, it has all the uh, the steels on the back here. We can go over that later. Uh, the field knife. This blew my mind. The field knife on the sock site right now is thirty nine ninety five. Okay, let's round this up because of taxes. You know that kind of bit. Let's just call this. Let's just call this twenty. And 20 is 40 bucks and then 40 bucks that's $80 right there in a package for 20 bucks at Walmart so head to your Walmart man I'm telling you 20 bucks my Walmart's uh there, there's like a few of them left and uh, what a deal this field knife alone is an incredible deal okay uh, for this price $39.95 is, uh, that was SOG site. So, this is the first SOG, this is the second SOG uh, knife I've bought since GSM uh, took over. Uh, the last one was the, uh, was a TELUS fixed blade knife. And then, uh, so this is the uh, only second knife I bought from the new uh, SOG. Uh, just, I found this interesting. I'll take a look at the sheath. Might be a nice little carry for work. I won't have to do anything to it. Okay, just a heads up. And I'll do some more videos this afternoon. I do have some things I wanted to show for some subscribers. They, they requested some overhead shots, but it might be tomorrow. I mean, SOG Sunday might turn into be uh, a miscellaneous thing too. I do that quite often. Y'all take care, have a great day. And I'm going to Cracker Barrel, have me some a nice lunch. SOG out.